So it's absolutely simple what I have to say to you. It's what my teacher said to me. And I'm still uh, deeply discovering the reverberation of that. And it's simply stop looking for what you want. Not cynically stop looking for what you want. Because there's a way of stopping looking for what you want in resignation and cynicism and closing down. But innocently, openly, stop looking for what you want in this moment. Not tomorrow when you have it. But in this moment, to take one moment, whatever it is you want, however mundane or profound, and just stop looking for it. And you will find more than what you could ever want. Because more than what can be wanted is already who you are. It's too simple to be grasped, but absolutely, completely realizable. If, and it is a huge if, of course, you are willing to give up your hope that what you want will be found in the next thought or the next activity or the next day or the next man or the next woman or the next teaching or the next experience. So that's huge. That's the challenge. And I've blessedly travel to Australia to challenge you <laughs> in that direction, that directionless direction. It's so simple that it has to be said over and over because it just slips right by the mind. And if it's said over and over and in enough ways and then not said, it can just be revealed. Not as something new, but as something absolutely fresh. Not new, but fresh. Who you are is not new, but it is always fresh. Who you think you are is old and dead. We just keep trying to think, think it a little better, squeeze some life. Did Is that clear? <laughs> it is? Because that's really the basis of what I have to say. It's not a teaching. It's not a belief system. It's not a, a way to live your life. It's not a, a should stop. It's not an, if you stop, you will be rich and famous and universally loved and never have a sad moment. None of that, I promise. <laughs> but if you're willing to investigate for yourself without believing it or learning it or hoping to get something from it, just a pure investigation out of the natural curiosity of the human mind. Just to investigate for yourself, what is here when I stop trying to get anything? And how much of that is here? And where does that begin? And where does that end? And then the question, 
Am I willing to trust that? And then the challenges get very big. But we'll get to that later. Any questions about what I just said? Want me to say it again? <laughs> you already are everything you want, only maybe not in the way you imagine what you want. And it's that imagination itself that keeps you from discovering that you already are everything you want. So if you just take this evening as an experiment to give up any imagination, any image of what you need to be totally fulfilled, just give it up. It's just an image, just a thought. Maybe a spiritual thought, maybe a worldly thought, a relationship thought, a career thought, just give it up and directly discover what's here, unthought, unimagined. How's that? Good, good. <laughs>